What is going on guys? Today I'm back with another banger. You already know how it is. Guys, today's video is going to be absolutely insane. So in my last video, you guys saw that the abandoned Apple store sent me a package to my house. One thing that you guys do not know is I never showed up to the place they told me to meet them, guys. I don't know why. I just felt creeped out. So I decided to not go. But today's going to be insane, guys. I am going to be going dumpster diving at the abandoned Apple store. I'm going to be going back. I have no clue what to expect. Expect, guys, I'm honestly super scared. But before we get started, I want everyone to go down there and smash the thumbs up button. I want at least 5,000 likes, 5,000 likes down below. You already know it is 5,000 likes is all I'm asking for. And make sure also hit that subscribe button with the post notification bell so you get notified when I upload new banger videos. So guys, without further ado, I'm gonna go get in my car and start making my way to the abandoned Apple store. All right, guys, so I'm on my my way to the abandoned apple store right now i'm honestly so scared like guys listen they sent me that package and they want me to work for them but the thing is i don't even know what they do they claim they're like a iphone repair shop which is just creepy as it is so i'm not sure guys i'm not even sure if i'm gonna find anything in the dumpster i just want to go to experiment and see maybe they left me something else maybe another note i have no clue the fact that they know where i live is just scary so i gotta end this before they start something you know what i mean right now we're like 15 minutes away so once i get there guys i'm gonna pick up the camera and we're gonna start dumpster diving all right guys we're literally pulling up to the abandoned apple store dumpster oh my god it's right there guys all right this is actually creepy. Oh my god, it's actually closed this time. All right, guys, I'm gonna get out of the car and start dumpster diving. All right, guys, I just got here. Oh my god, I'm honestly scared, guys. Let's check the dumpster. Oh my god, there's no one top of this half, but not this half. This is so weird, guys. Oh my god, okay, let's unbox it. Let's see. Oh, there's like blue bins. This, these are like brand new. Oh my god, there's a car right there. Okay, this is weird, guys. Like a blue bin here. Oh my god. Look, another full box with Apple products. Hold up. Hold up, guys. Hold up. Oh my god. Look at this. This is insane. Oh my god, a box full with iPhone boxes. No way. Guys, this is so weird. Like, look at them right now, guys. There's literally nobody outside, nothing. All right, let's put this in the car. Let's put this in the car. Oh my God, this is actually absolutely insane. Plus, guys, it's so cold out right now. It's literally freezing. I'm freezing right now. My hands are literally about to fall off. But you know what? There's a second dumpster right there. The green one, we haven't even, like, went to see it. So I want to see if I can find anything in there. Oh my God, ice everywhere. All right, guys, let's see if anything is in here. Oh! <gasps> Nothing, just a bunch of bags. Oh my god. Guys, this is weird. Oh, what is this? Oh, oh. Who are you? Who are you? Don't worry about that. What are you doing here? I just wanted to dumpster dive, that's it. I told you, you have to work with us. Well, what do you mean work with you? What do you guys do? We're an iPhone repair shop iPhone repair shop, but clearly not because I was clearly on to you guys and you guys didn't do nothing You want us to do something? We can No, I don't want you to do anything, but there's something up with you guys and I know it Are you either have to work with us or something happens to you? Okay, listen, you guys clearly don't just fix iPhones or whatever that is You guys do more than that. What is it? If you join us, we'll tell you No, I want to know You have to join us to know Leave now or I'll eat you. Oh, guys. oh my god, alright guys, we're gonna leave. This guy's literally got like a garbage bag over his head. Look at him. Look at him. That is so weird. Alright guys, this is just too creepy. It doesn't look like he wants to hurt me, but he wants to eat me. <laughs> guys, what kind of stuff is this? Well, anyway guys, I'm gonna get in the car right now. This guy's just looking at me. Look at him. He's not coming towards me. I don't think he can see really good through that. Well, anyway guys, I'm gonna get home. And once I get home, I'm gonna look inside the box and see what's inside of it. Alright guys. I'm back home. That was honestly so scary. Like, you guys saw him, he was just staring at me. Oh my god, guys. I'm actually creeped out, but this is the box we got right here. You already should know how it is, guys. I'm just so weirded out. Like, listen. Was that garbage guy just waiting there the whole time, waiting for someone to dumpster dive? Maybe they don't want me to dumpster dive there. I have no clue, guys. It's creepy. And, like, you heard what he said. He wants me to work for them, but I'm pretty sure they're up to something, guys. They're not only an iPhone repair shop, because if they're only an iPhone repair shop, why would you want workers that bad? 
And the fact that he wasn't even chasing me and that Indy said he was gonna eat me. Guys, that's hilarious. What does it mean he's gonna eat me? I don't know, guys. I think it's just people messing around with me. But anyway, guys, let's get into the dumpster diving right here. Let's see what we got. All right. An iPad Pro. Okay, let's see if anything's inside. Nothing in there. Let's see if it's got stickers. No stickers, nothing. All right. An empty iPad box. Huh? I mean, why is there even stuff in there? I swear they're trying to bait me for some reason. A MacBook? No way. Anything in here? Okay, I don't think they come with stickers. All right, nothing in the iPad or MacBook box. We got an iPhone XS here, and... Woohoo! We got stickers, let's go. See, the thing is, they said they want to pay me an iPhone products, but I mean, I just go dumpster dive there and I get it for free, you know? It's like, they threw it out. Like, they clearly don't want it. Like, if it's in the dumpster, we got more stickers here. I mean, if it's in the dumpster, it's eventually just gonna go get crushed, you know? So it's pretty much just like garbage, garbage, you know? Just waste. So if I could take it and recycle it myself, hoo -hoo, we got a pin. I mean, if I recycle it, you know, it's better for the environment. Cause it's all pollution out here, you know? So me taking these boxes is actually good for the environment because I like collecting them, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> all right, we got an iPhone 7 right here. Okay, empty. All right. This box doesn't look too, too promising, guys. I don't think we're gonna find anything in here. Okay, this is empty. Any stickers in here? No stickers, nothing. What is this? All right, all right. We just gotta keep looking, brother. All right, here we go iPhone XS and I don't think it's got oh we got a pin let's go we actually stickers and a pin no way I called the stickers a pin and then I called the pin a stickers you know I'm a little cool mixed up here brother all right another iPhone 11 no way that's a lot of iPhone 11s let's see <laughs> more stickers all right we already snow the vibes guys we're making Good amount of money right here. Each one of these boxes is worth about five dollars. We got the pin right here. Let's go. This is the pin, as you see. So we got a pin there. And the stickers are worth twenty dollars. I seen on eBay, so um, I'm not sure about that. And the pins are actually five dollars a piece. Oh, we got some stuff here. We got an iPhone charger right here. Okay, the thing is bent right here. I don't know if you guys see that. It looks a little bent. It should still work. All right, what else we got here? Oh, this is for the screens, I think. Pretty sure the screens just sit in here. Yeah, they do, look at that. This is like how you protect the glass part. We got an iPhone 6 Plus screen. We got an iPhone broken screen. We got another screen right here and another screen. No way, four screens. Guys, this one is cracked. This one is worth no money, but these ones right here should be worth $100 each. So let's go. We're actually cashing out, bro. All right. Let's see what else. Oh, we got a hair in here. Uh, all right, an iPhone 6 Plus back. No, bud, no, bud. Oh, we got another iPhone. Oh, another iPhone front. Okay, another hundred dollars right here. We got some headphones, another thirty, forty dollars. We got a brick right here for the iPad. All right, this should be like twenty dollars, brother. Okay, this is an iPhone Seven Plus. I'm pretty sure. Oh, we got stickers in here. Okay, okay. You don't already know. All right, what else is this? Another iPhone X. This is a normal X. I mean, the box looks empty already, but we got stickers and a pin. No way. Guys, if you know, I love the stickers. That's my favorite part. I don't even care about getting phones because I've gotten so many over the times and I've given away so many. And this one is empty. All right, last box right here, guys. iPad Air and... Oh, it's empty. All right, guys, so as you saw, that was the creepiest thing ever, going back to the iPhone repair shop slash abandoned Apple store. That was a creepy experience. Good thing I didn't take my little sister with me that time, because that guy was just, like, weird. Maybe they're just stalkers. I don't know. I have no clue, guys. I don't know what they're up to. If you want me to go back, please go down there, smash the thumbs up button, hit the subscribe button with the post notification bell so you get notified if I do go back. But I'm not sure if I want to go back, to be honest. It's just like a little creepy, you know what I'm saying? Like, guys, I'm honestly not sure what to do about this situation. Like, do you guys think I should go back? Because what's going to happen? Like, this guy was telling me he's going to eat me. The thing is, he wasn't even going to walk. He had a garbage bag over his head. All I saw was his eye. And guys, let me tell you, that looked creepy. Like, you guys saw it. His voice was scary, too. Like, 
Like I'm thinking it might be linked to those iPhone repair shops that I did like a year ago. I don't know guys, I think it's some like mysterious stuff. I should investigate more, but I need to find a way to actually get inside guys. So I'm gonna need you guys to put on your super brains and comment down below ideas of how I could get in there and get closer to them and see what exactly what they do. Well anyway guys, I might just do normal dumpster diving, but if you want me to go to this abandoned Apple store specifically, comment and let me know. But anyway guys, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and as always, peace!